recognized symbol of excellence in sports entertainment. Hello wrestling fans and welcome to WCW Saturday Night. We have a great show lined up for you tonight. We begin things with Two Cold Scorpio taking on Terry Taylor. As these two men rising up the ranks in the world television title contention ladder. So we know that Mr. Wonderful Paul Lorndorf will be keeping an eye on this match. We will also see Cactus Jack take on Ravishing Rick Rude in a non-title NWA match. If Cactus Jack can win the match, he will receive an NWA World Title match at next month's pay-per-view Super Brawl. And we will end today's show with some highlights from a recent match in which the Hollywood Blondes defended the NWA World Tag Team Championship against Arn Anderson and Beautiful Bobby as Scorpio has Terry Taylor up against the ropes. Will we get a clean break? We do. And a beautiful maneuver by Terry Taylor with a monkey flip over goes to Cold Scorpio. Taylor, the veteran, working over the youngster Scorpio who of course in recent weeks has made his climb up to the World TV title rankings. He's also a top contender for the World Tag Team Championship with Marcus Alexander Bagwell. So two cold Scorpio, a force to be reckoned with here in World Championship Wrestling. Terry Taylor now working the arm of two cold Scorpio. Scorpio trying to maneuver out, rolls over, and an elbow to the side of the head breaks the maneuver nicely done by Scorpio, but Taylor back in control. Runs, charges, misses the monkey flip that time, and a big clothesline by Scorpio takes down Terry Taylor. Scorpio with a big uppercut, Taylor in trouble, and a leg drop by Scorpio. Does not go for the cover, and that's the inexperience of two quote Scorpio right there. Instead, he picks up Taylor, and a beautiful spinning heel kick. Down goes Taylor. Scorpio goes for the cover now. Referee counts one, and a kick out of one. Wow, Terry Taylor kicking out at one. Scorpio not done with a series of forearms to the face. A big chop. Throws Taylor into the ropes. Oh, and Scorpio misses with a clothesline. Taylor now throws Scorpio into the turnbuckle. And the veteran misses with a drop kick. Scorpio nails a clothesline that time, and now Scorpio going up top. What's he have in store here? Terry Taylor in trouble. And a beautiful drop kick from the top rope by two cold Scorpio. That has to be all. The free counts one and a kick out of one by Taylor. Wow, Terry Taylor. Kicking out at one, and now has Scorpio up in a beautiful power bomb by Taylor. Taylor goes for the cover. Referee counts one, two, and no, a kick out by Scorpio. Taylor thought that was all, questioning the cadence of the count to the official. I don't think a referee is ever going to say, oh, yeah, you're right, I went too slow as Taylor sets up. Oh, and a big five arm. There it is. That has to be all. Taylor on top, one, two, and three, no! Scorpio kicked out, Taylor having words with the referee. And 
And I thought this match was over right there. The flying five arm by Terry Taylor did not put Scorpio away. But again, the smart ring veteran that Terry Taylor is staying on top of Scorpio. Scorpio trying to mount a comeback with an elbow to the side of the head. Throws Taylor into the ropes. Runs, charges, clothesline. Down goes Taylor. Now Scorpio with a beautiful maneuver here, pulling back on the neck with his knee in the back of Terry Taylor. And that bought Scorpio some time because he was putting pressure on the neck of Terry Taylor while also taking a breather. But Scorpio now rolls out to the outside. He's in trouble. Taylor follows suit. Now they're exchanging blows on the outside. The referee's begun to count. Scorpio throws Taylor back into the ring. Scorpio now, a big uppercut. Down goes Taylor. Scorpio again climbing the top rope. The last time we saw a drop kick, but we see this time he leaps and a 450 splash on Taylor. He hooks the leg. Referee position one, two, and three. And your winner, two, Cold Scorpio. What a back and forth match this was. A great wrestling match between Terry Taylor and two Cold Scorpio. And don't look now, but look who's making his way down the aisle. The world television champion, Mr. Wonderful Paul Lorndorf. Who's, who's congratulating Scorpio on the victory, fans. We have much more Saturday night to come. We're going to hear from Flying Brian Pillman next. Don't go away. Welcome back to Saturday night, and I, I don't believe what I just heard there. That's flying Brian Pillman trying to make overtures to have Barry Windham join the Hollywood Blondes. I mean, <laughs> if Barry Windham joined them, they would be an unstoppable force. But I find it ironic because Barry Windham and Dustin Rhodes are currently the number one contenders to the WCW World Tag Team Championship. Cactus now firing away on Rick Rude. This is a non-title match. If Cactus Jack can get a victory over Rick Rude, he will get an NWA World Title match next month at Super Brawl. Just the thought of Cactus Jack being an NWA World Champion, well, I guess we've seen Stranger Things as he throws Rude into the ropes and Rude meets him with a big forearm smash. Rude using his strength and his speed against Cactus Jack here, has Cactus against the ropes and slings him back. It's not mere takeover, down goes Cactus. And Rude slowing down the pace with a chin lock on Cactus Jack Manson. Who escapes the maneuver by dropping down. Nicely done on the part of Cactus. But Rick Rude showing his strength for the press slam. Down goes Cactus Jack. And Rick Rude in control in this back and forth matchup. And there was a shot to the kidneys up to Cactus Jack. Cactus Jack down, and Rude now pulling Cactus to the center of the ring. Is he going to go for a pinfall? He does. Rude on top, letter press one, two, and th no, a kick out at the last second by Cactus Jack. And Rude thought that was three, but it was not, and Cactus now, scoop slam. 
off the ropes, and Cactus drops a leg across the throat of Ravishing Rick Rude. And a swinging neckbreaker by Cactus Jack Manson. Setting up Rude, could we see that double arm DDT? He has, no, he's gonna set him up for a power driver. Cactus has him up and spikes him down. Can Cactus win? He hooks the leg. Will he get a world title match? One, two, and no, a kick out by Rude. And Cactus can't believe, I can't believe it. Rude kicked out of that stump pile driver. And now these two men exchanging blows. Rude has Cactus up for a pile driver of his own and spikes Cactus down. And now we're going over to the turnbuckle pad. He's, he's untying that top turnbuckle pad. The referee saw him do it, but I guess he can't disqualify Rude until he tries to throw Cactus into it. And now Rude climbing the top rope. Cactus prone on the mat and an elbow drop from the top rope. Rude hooks the leg, one, two, and no, a kick out by Cactus again. Rude now going to work on Cactus Jack's neck. The Cactus escapes the maneuver. The referee putting the turnbuckle pad back. Wait, wait a second, no! Rude with a low blow, the referee didn't see it. He was tying the turnbuckle pad back on. Cactus holding his groin, it was a low blow by Rude who's setting up Cactus now, kick to the midsection. Here it comes, the Rude awakening down on Cactus. Rude goes for the cover, on top one, two, and three. Your winner, Ravishing Rick Rude, Cactus Jack, will not get an NWA World Tunnel opportunity at Super Brawl. Here are some highlights, a back and forth match between these two men. But it was a distraction of the turnbuckle pad that Rick Rude took off. The referee was tying it back on. And that gave Rick Rude a chance to low blow Cactus Jack behind the referee's back. And secure the victory. There's that stump pile driver by Cactus. I thought it was all over here. So Cactus Jack will not be the one challenging Rick Rude for the NWA World title at Super Brawl. We don't know who that challenger will be. But we have many more weeks to find, well, only a few more weeks to find out, actually, as Rick Rude, your winner here, fans, don't go away. We have highlights from this past week's match at the Omni when the Hollywood Blondes defended the NWA World Tag Team Championship against Arn Anderson and Beautiful Bobby. We'll be right back. Fans, we're going to take you back to this past week in the Omni in Atlanta. History was made as Arn Anderson and Beautiful Bobby defeated the Hollywood Blondes for the NWA World Tag Team Championship. Only the NWA World Tag Team Championship was on the line in this contest. We're going to take you now to the closing moments of that match last week at the Omni.